How's it going guys? Derek Hallett here, unrealliving.com, giving you four cycle tour tips. It's gonna be four separate videos for each cycle tour tip. All the other uh, links to all the other videos will be in the description uh, right below. Third tip that I wish I'd known when I was in Southeast Asia is how to actually take care of my bicycle. It sounds super simple, but a lot of these things that you don't really think of when you're gonna go on a cycle tour. Now, I could have probably gotten at least another couple thousand kilometers out of my drivetrain if I'd, if I'd have known how to take care of it properly. But I had to replace the crank set, the chain, and the rear cassette on it already after about 5,000 kilometers of riding. And you know, you, you can ask different people and they'll give you a different answer on how, um, how much distance you'll actually get out of it. But I took very poor care of it. I never cleaned it. And I still got about 5,000 kilometers out of it. So that's actually not that bad. Uh, but basic, basic thing that you want to be doing is you want to either take some kind of rag or an old t-shirt or something like that. And what you want to do is basically wrap this right around your chain, pedal backwards to clean off any, any uh, gook or grime on it that is basically accumulated after you've been doing uh, so many kilometers. And how many kilometers do you know to really start to clean, clean your chain? You know, I'd say probably if you're doing a lot of miles every day, maybe every two to three days. And after that, you know, grab your favorite uh, chain lube here to, um, to basically lube it all up. Once, once you've lubed it up, again, take this to wipe off any excess oil. Because the reason why you want to wipe off the excess oil is so that basically when any, uh, any, any particles, any um, you know, dirt and sand and stuff gets on the chain, it's not going to have as much uh, lube to basically grab onto because that's really one of the things that actually helps the basically the drivetrain wear quicker is all the dirt and all the grime and stuff on it. Now say you have like a really really sludgy kind of drivetrain, you haven't cleaned it in a long time, grab something like a kerosene or something like that, a nice degreaser to basically clean everything off really really spick and spam. The other thing to clean off your bike is to use some sort of furniture polish and this is just on basically just the standard parts on your bike, not on the drivetrain itself. So this is just, you know, helps you clean it off, gets all the gets all the dirt and all the grime off your bike. And so actually, this is the actual, the lube that I use is Pedro's uh, Go. It's a low viscosity chain lube. It's also, it's a, I believe it's, it's, a, it's a biodegradable uh, vegetable base um, uh, chain lube. So that's, that's what I'm gonna be using on my next little bike trip. So hopefully everything goes well. The other thing would be to pop off the back wheel and then you wanna clean through the cassettes. You wanna clean through the cassette. So you take a rag like this and all you do is you basically just kinda of go through the cassette between each sprocket and just kinda of clean it as if you're like flossing your teeth. And that just gets all the, all the, all, all the, all the grime off the cassette and the same thing on the crank set as well. You wanna be cleaning that off. If it's really, really grimy, then you probably want to have to use a brush or something like that to get all of it off um, using a degreaser as well. So that's my third tip for you guys. Hope you enjoyed that one. Stay tuned for number four. All the links for all the other, uh, for all the other tips, for the three other tips that I'm giving you guys is going to be below in the description. So check those out. And I hope you guys are having an awesome day. Get out there, go cycle touring, enjoy yourself. Subscribe to this channel if you want to see my big cycle tour, 3,000 kilometers here through, uh, through Australia. And if you like the video, definitely like it or dislike it. If you have any questions or comments about the tips, definitely leave them below. And we will uh, talk to you guys super soon. Have a great day. Peace out.